time for me is getting up in the morning, uh, getting my kids to school. Being in a clock shop like this with antique clocks, it's very much being in perhaps a geriatric ward of a hospital. And you're dealing with, with uh, your clients, your clocks, your timepieces are quite aged. They can be anything from sort of 50 to 300 years old. And they all have little quirks, their ways, how they behave. And uh, the problems that materialize are different for each because after 100 years, the problem for a mechanical item is different than something after 200 years. And they present differently. Um, some of them would drive you mad. You know, you, you, people say, oh, you must have so much patience. But your patience is exhausted by the time you go home. Um, so time for me is entirely occupying most of my day. Time and tide wait for no man. Things ebb and flow beyond our control. The sun rises, the sun falls, and we are just here, you know. And I'm no longer 21, I'm 54.